good YouTube, Noah Gaming back with yet another LSPDFR video. Today, I have a simple fix for you guys. It is the new DIN put. It came out in August. I want to, no, okay, August. April? Motherfucker, I don't know. I know many people's DIN puts that they have in their GTA 5 is 2015 still. So I'm going to get you guys that. And I'm going to show you guys how to upgrade your game config so it can be compatible with the newest GTA 5 update. Smash the like button if this video does help you guys out. It would be greatly appreciated. And go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you are new to the channel any sub is greatly appreciated <laughs> i mean we we love new subs who doesn't love new subscribers man i mean i'm doing it for you guys right go ahead and press the subscribe button i'm here to help you out anyways let's get right into the video first things first check the description boys you guys should find the newest then put what the f <laughs> I just might say 9 20 2025. I'm telling you, I got the most updated. I don't know how I keep getting it the most updated, but it is the most updated. Literally. 920. That's literally yesterday. So I don't know how that's there. Okay, date created 4 6 2025. It's okay, it's still somewhere along the lines of there. It's still 2025 instead of 2015. So go ahead and drop that. I mean, go ahead and drop that. <laughs> drop that dun 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 stupid. Ass. Anyway. Damn. I suck at this shit. <laughs> Check the description. This should be in the description. Go ahead and download it. I'm going to find a way for you guys to download it. So go ahead and download it. Simply just drag or drop into your GTA 5 My Directory and done deal. So that's taken care of. Next is game config. So let's go into our browser. Close out all this. Don't worry about any of this voice. Um, let's go to GTA 5 mods. And then boom, here we are. Let's go to game. We could just type in game. Pretty sure it should pop up. There it is gta 5 game config for legacy and enhanced so anytime gta updates itself or you know they come out with a new patch note or a new update um whatever they plan on doing you guys need to update this so let's go ahead and download this go ahead and click download if we download the top right i've already downloaded i've already fixed my game so we we should be good boys we're going to open that close that out go to our main directory i lied so what we want to do once we have this, this is the uh, the game config. We're going to go to GTA 5. More mods. Always press more mods, okay? Nobody is putting less mods into their game. Always press more mods. Me, personally, I love to have more traffic and more peds. So I'm going to scroll down to 3.5 traffic, 3.5 peds. I recommend if you have a standard PC, not a top of the line PC or, you know, above average, I'd go with stock. I'm going to use 3.5 and 3.5. We're going to open that. And right here, we have our game config XML. So you will need open IV open iv is right here we're going to click into that and if you don't have this set up if this is your first time doing this i'm going to show you guys how to do that right now so i'm going to change my gta 5 game folder so i can go ahead and do that so let's just put an extra v boom it's changed close it out so when you open it it should look something like this and then what we're going to do is we're just going to go to browse and it's wherever your main directory or wherever you downloaded it gta 5 at if you don't know where that's at and you're on steam we can open up steam we can help you find this out really quick so now that we're in steam we're gonna go over to library at the top we're gonna scroll down till we see our gta 5 which is right here right click on your mouse we're gonna click <clears throat> manage and we're gonna go over and we're gonna go down to browse local files Okay, so you would press browse local files and it would pop up, but mine isn't working because I changed the name. If I change it back, it'll work. So basically, you would just go to wherever your thing, wherever your stuff is downloaded. So mine would be SS Steam. Scroll down to Common. No, it's Steam, Steam Apps. Then it's Common. Then boom, GTA 5. And when you select the folder, everything should pop up. All right, I'm breaking the fourth wall real quick. I just, okay, right where I was just editing this, it didn't make any sense, so I'm gonna explain it really quick. Basically what I was saying with the main directory in Steam. So let me go ahead and open up Steam real quick and show you guys what I'm talking about. Okay, Steam is open. Basically what I was saying was go to library, find your GTA 5, which mine is right here. Right click on it, go to manage, and then browse local files. This folder should pop up. Mine didn't pop up because I changed the game name and I never showed you guys me changing it back and then the folder popping up. This is the path that you want to follow. So once you open up OpenIV, let's open that really quick. I might have to rechange it. I don't know. Okay, so boom, there we go. It's perfect. So we're going to click browse. So look, we're going to follow this path. This is your main directory folder if you guys don't know how to get to it. And we just did it through Steam. So we're going to follow that same path to link the OpenIV to your Steam or to your um, main directory. Directory. so we're gonna go to local d that just sounds crazy ss boom steam 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 apps scroll down to steam apps common common and then grand theft auto 5 is right there go ahead and click that and it should basically do the same thing as in the other video and you guys should be good boom just like that let's get back to the video uh it should load in 
and then you should get this green check mark go ahead and click continue and it's going to boot up open iv then once you're in here if this is your first time using this sorry for all my experienced users who have to sit through this go ahead and skip the video but if you are new you know i'm being very helpful click this asi manager up here at the top you want to make sure you have all of these installed okay so all these are going to be kind of blue for you just go ahead and click install 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 simple probably take like two seconds and then up here at the top make sure you toggle edit mode so go ahead and click f6 i just untoggled it but if i click it f6 again we'll toggle edit mode and that is that those are the two main things you need as soon as you get this and then what we're going to do is we're going to go and update our game config right here that we have so we're going to go to mods update okay let me think about a beginner some beginners might not have the mods folder so if you don't have the mods folder go ahead and click into update if you do have the mods folder you can just follow along too click update click update rpf and you should get prompted with this the mods folder we can hit show in mods folder then we're going to click common data and then we're going to scroll down as you can see right here game config xml game config xml now we're going to drag and drop this even though it says 92 kb compressed that means it's already been modded and man manipulated it might say the same thing so once i drag and drop this it might not look like it does anything and as you can see it still says 92 kb compress so you're getting close out of that and then that's that so you guys have the den put you guys have the game config and you guys should be set i'm gonna launch my game really quick we're gonna hold shift once we are in here um again if your game is crashing a lot i would recommend clicking this don't load any plugins on startup but me i have a decent pc i know everything is gonna work and load in so i'm gonna hit load these plugins on startup make sure you guys set this yours is gonna be something like this if you, this is your first time you know what i'm saying updating or installing it i recommend setting it to 60 000 everything else looks good again if your pc is poo poo go ahead and press this if it's not poo poo press that save and launch and i'll see you guys in the game ah. all right boys we are back let's go ahead and matter of fact let's go ahead and force duty oh no oh no oh no so our game crashed on f4 mm, it's not looking too good boys go and boot it up again let me see what's wrong with this all right i'm back uh, ah. all right let's see if we press f4 my game crashes again what? five years later uh, gta5 this cryptic v.net control c control v save that Scroll up to Rage Plugin Hook. See how that was F4 and the other one was F4? No bueno. Now let's try it again. All right. Let's see if this shit crashes. F4. <laughs> I knew it. I'm a sensation. Reload all plugins. Let's go and click Tab, Enter. Let's go and load everything in. All right. Most of them are loaded in. Let's go and change our clothes. Okay. Not really fucking with it, but it's cool. And then let's go ahead and find us a little police car. Show me available calls. All right, let's see if we can get a little call for you guys. Hey, mama, mama, hey, mama, mama. Let me catch nobody with underglow. Look, intoxication. And we're. Right, we got a little public intoxication. Let's go ahead over there really quick. Got a code three. Let me get some backup. Some local patrol is gonna back me up as well. It's like a lady, boys. Uh, I can see her uh, fall over already. <clears throat> okay, my backup over here hitting people, bro. I see that man on the ground getting up. Who gave you your goddamn license, man? Hey, you're stumbling quite a bit. Have you been drinking? No, I just, the sidewalk is uneven. We know. I can smell it. Sidewall looks fine to me. I think you've had too much to drink. Nah, I'm good. Just need to find my car. Hey, that motherfucker sound like me right now. You're not driving anywhere. Let's get you some help. I, I don't want your help. Let's calm down. I just want to talk and resolve this peacefully. Nobody needs to get hurt. Really Said no. Go ahead, Taser. Go ahead, Taser. Oh, suspect is on the one. It's on the one. <laughs> <Good. laughs> on the one? Bro, what is wrong with my fucking speech right now? Taser, Taser. 
Suspect been tased. Put your hands up, man. Put your hands up. Okay, suspect has been apprehended and is in cuffs. Let's go ahead and uh, pat her down real quick. He is definitely under the influence. See if she has any drugs on her or any more alcohol. A liquor receipt. Okay, nothing too crazy. Dispatch, can we get a transmitter for this suspect? Get her back to the station. We're going to put her in holding for 48. Nah, 48 is kind of crazy. 24 hours just so she sobers up. Maybe call a family or relative to let them know that she is at the station so they don't file a missing complaint. If this has helped you guys uh, in any sort of way, resolving your issues with your game crashing, go ahead and press the subscribe button. It is greatly appreciated. And don't be afraid to smack that like button okay i'm looking at you yeah you. this is noah gaming and i'll see you guys in the and i'll see you guys in this is noah gaming and i'll see you guys in the next one